Are you guys looking to replace your crappy factory plastic turbo inlet on your 15 plus WRX? This is the Perrin 3 inch turbo inlet. What's up guys, Rick with Raleigh Sport Direct here. In front of me, I have the brand new Perrin 3 inch turbo inlet specific for the 2015 plus WRX. Now Perrin just sent this to me, so I figured, hey, why not do an unboxing here? And so let's go ahead and open this thing up. So right on top, we've got some uh, instructions, it looks like, and some hardware. Uh, looks like it includes all of the clamps you're going to need and all of the fittings you're going to need as well. And then of course you've got your uh, inlet adapter and your actual inlet as well. And that looks like about it. So let's go ahead and talk about the actual inlet itself. And I guess I should, I probably should have opened this up before the video started, but we can go ahead and unwrap this. And this is actually one thing I do appreciate about Perrin products is just how well they come wrapped, even though it is a little bit frustrating to do this when you're trying to do a video quickly and efficiently, but you know what? This is just all good in my opinion, so we're okay here, if you guys don't mind. At least it comes well packaged. All right, so that's the actual inlet hose itself. Now in contrast, compared to the factory inlet hose, this thing is incredibly smooth. Now I wish I could get the camera maybe the top camera down in there to show exactly how smooth that in uh, that is. But the factory one is this like accordion like, you know, turbo inlet hose. And uh, it has a lot of restrictions, especially in this area. Um, and then also where it attaches to the turbo. And that's where this piece also comes into play. Let's go ahead and open this up. Now, this is a thing of beauty. You can see it's almost like what would you call that, like a Venturi type um, or a trumpet, very nice smooth flow down into that turbo inlet or the actual turbo itself. And of course you have your cutout here for your gasket, uh, which is very nice. So you can use your OEM uh, O-ring, I guess we'll call it an O-ring. Um, but that smooth diameter is exactly what you want in a turbo inlet. You don't want any, you know, harsh uh, lips or bends or anything like that. And so Perrin has done an awesome job of keeping this as smooth as possible. And honestly, they've killed it. And of course it does have all of your factory hookups, including your bypass valve um, and all of your PCV system, which is very cool. So what else is included? Of course, all the hardware you're gonna need to install it, instructions on how to install it. Now installation of this, that's probably gonna be the trickiest part, right? Because you have to have the car up in the air. You have to take off the under tray. Uh, the factory piece, in my opinion, this part isn't hard to take off. It's this bypass valve connection because you have you know, this piece attached here. You've got your turbo attached here, your bypass valve here. Um, and it's all just really tight. So you kind of have to w wiggle it all off and uh, it's, it's a little bit tricky, but once you get that off, I imagine this piece is going to be a lot easier to install than the factory one is to take off. And that's very, very cool. Now, the problem with the factory piece is it's all like this hard, crappy plastic, um, which, you know, if you've got a brand new car, you, you probably won't see any issues with it. But as cars age, that plastic becomes brittle as you're taking things on and off eventually. And I thought I've broken our factory one a few times, um, but uh, you know, it, it will break eventually and it's prone to leak because that this, the plastic connection here just isn't very good. And these can actually wiggle a little bit. You can get a vacuum leak, which sucks because it's post MAF pre turbo. Uh, and so the car can actually lean out quite a bit and that's very, very dangerous. Um, and so a piece like this can not only, you know, gain a little bit of performance, a little bit better throttle response, uh, it can also last a lot longer than stock, probably the lifetime of the car, but it also prevents potentially catastrophic failure as well. So Perrin has done a bang up job on this and I absolutely love this, you know, all aluminum CNC, beautifully constructed, very high quality reinforced silicone. So even if you're running a big bad boy turbo, you're not gonna be able to suck that thing in. Uh, and that's the problem with some cheaper inlets is, you know, as you get, as you get some restriction on the air filter, it creates a lot of vacuum in this and it can actually suck that piece. And I'm sure you guys have seen videos of that on the interwebs, um, but Perrin, Good job on this. 
Uh, stoked to show you guys their new turbo inlet hose for the 15 plus WRX. And uh, we'll probably actually be installing this on one of the WRXs here. So stay tuned for a future video on that. Thank you very much. We'll see you guys next time.